Coincheck was hacked for 58 billion yen. Hey, I'm Man Technic. If this is your first time stopping by the channel, make sure you hit the subscribe button and the bell below so you're notified when I post my latest updates. Let's get right into it. We have breaking news. Let's head over to the desk. Here's Man Technic. <laughs> So I keep bringing up crypto security and how important it is to secure the tokens or coins that you're out there purchasing. No matter what marketplace you're in, when you buy these tokens or coins, you want to make sure if you're holding on to them for the long term that you are properly securing them, whether it be in a hardware wallet or a paper wallet. Those are the two most secure uh, ways to protect your cryptocurrency. If you're leaving your money and your crypto sitting in the exchanges, it's not advised. If you're doing that, you should be trading, actively trading with that currency. You shouldn't just leave anything you're playing on hodling sitting in a marketplace because these marketplaces are extremely susceptible to attack. Until yesterday, the biggest crypto hack was Mt. Gox, which in 2014 was hacked for $340 billion in Bitcoin. I believe it was 700,000 Bitcoins were actually hacked from the Mt. Gox marketplace. Well, that has been surpassed. Coincheck is a large Tokyo-based uh, crypto marketplace, and yesterday they had 500 million NEM or NEM tokens stolen from their marketplace. So this has surpassed Mt. Gox of 2014 by almost $200 million. I understand the market cap in, in the crypto market is a little bit different, but it's still important that you secure your cryptocurrency. If you don't know how to secure your cryptocurrency, I made a previous video that you can click. You'll see the link above. Click that. Make sure you watch it. I advise securing your crypto in a paper wallet or a wallet similar to the Ledger Nano S or the Tracer hardware wallet. These allow you to store your crypto offline so no one has access to them. If you're spending the time to invest and the money to invest in cryptocurrency, you must secure that stuff first. If you don't secure it, you have no business trading. I'm Man Technic. If this is your first time stopping by the channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button and the bell below so you're notified when I post my latest updates. Check me out on Facebook at Man Technic and my website www.mantechnic.com. Be sure to hit the like button below and drop me a comment. I'm Man Technic. I'm out. Peace.